Hi everybody, I'm Tina. This is To The Inner Well. Thanks for stopping by. Welcome back to all you practitioners of love and light currently active. Um, all others are not welcome here. Um, just because the prerequisite for this is uh, working from your heart chakra. Um, for you to understand. <laughs> um, otherwise, you're due to understand. <laughs> I must say <laughs> that if you <laughs> insist, you shall w learn under different terms. <laughs> yep, yep. For real. And it shall hit your domestic environment so that you feel it. But this is for your own good. This is for everybody's own good, you know. Ownership. Accountability within the home. <sighs> to stabilize. To self-actualize. Mm hmm we have the three of pentacles, actually the three of wands lit right here. Um, it's seeing things come into fruition. That energetic cord, you know, from source. Where is that? Right there. Let's see. So this is, this is all in all a good deal. It, it, it looks like it's Thanksgiving. There's a turkey on the table. You know, interesting. <laughs> that just came out. You saw it. You saw it. Um, things are coming, uh, to fruition. <laughs> they are. Like, <laughs> last night, seriously, I, I decided, like, I'm not gonna put too much on my plate. I have to listen to the messages, and, um, there's so much that I want to do. Um, I just, I gotta, like, prioritize, and, and it's okay. <laughs> um, life is meant to be felt, not just done. <laughs> So, um, that's where I'm at. It's a good discovery. It's subtle, but it's delicious. I like it. I got, um, uh, a little, like, another random act of kindness. I don't know what's going on. Like, I, I, I don't think that within my locality that people who are already established here, I don't know. It's just really weird. Like, I feel like people are quietly gifted. Mm. So whether they practice like in their witchery or whatever, um, they know, they like, I don't know how other witches know that I'm a, well, I guess, I guess I'm obvious about it, but, um, like if there's a lot of distance, if there's stuff in between us on a norm, like how, how would you really know? I, I, I don't know. Um, I don't feel like I'm that obvious, but, um, anyway, it's like, which is, you know, I mean, I mean this in a good way, obviously, but they, like, I don't, we don't even, we don't even need to conversate. There's something like, um, like a secret, um, like it's a secret society where you acknowledge that there are certain challenges that you face. Otherwise you wouldn't be in the practice of this type of resource, which is good. It's just like tapping into the unknown and that's oftentimes scary to others. And oftentimes also um, frowned upon depending on what culture or religion you come from. And, and so anyway, I remember like on a, full moon type of it was still the day but I emerged from the store and one of the ladies was like right before leaving offered um me and my son some plants you know and like for free and she's like oh, I was just gonna like do it whatever but she you know and then today I got a free muffin <laughs> but um it I don't understand it like you're you don't really talk about it um, most don't talk about it because a lot of the times they don't want, um, to throw anybody under the bus and it's just like a quiet thank you that's supposed to be taken in a humble form, um, as, as equal to it being given, um, that the gesture like resonates like within that very moment and it's just like a, you know, like a secret, sacred thank you and it, it and goes along in many forms like last night holy shit i like i had the best feel goods ever like i felt like i was being upgraded like regenerated and it was you know i had to retire to bed a little bit um earlier than i had liked because i started feeling like kind of under the weather like my head started getting at it again 
um I, I just don't, like, I forget, I don't realize what spirit means when, like, they say, like, don't put yourself out there too much. Um, like, uh, if somebody does, like, a public good service and you say thank you, like, et cetera, et cetera, that's also putting yourself out there because as soon as I told the person, like, I don't have a headache anymore, um, I, I got, like, the headache again. And it was just, like, even after, like, revisiting their services, I, like, it just wasn't potent anymore. So it's like, holy crud. Seriously. You've got to be watchful. So, um, anyway, here we are. Clappity clap, clap, clap. Um, disclaimer, there's about four or five cards missing here that are sitting on my bed. I, I just, um, felt the need to do an energy reading here. So I, I believe that we're still going to get, um, the messages that we need. So, 10.30 on the clock. 10.33 to be exact. And we're answering. Well, angels of light and love, I welcome you in to direct and protect these messages. My chakras, my auras, <clears throat> my space, and that of my viewers and fam. Alright. <clears throat> Nine of Cups. Happiness. Happiness. This is excellent. Being satisfied. Like, chill. Mm-hmm. <laughs> This is good. Yeah, one cup at a time. And we're we're detoxing. We're we're enjoying the um realm of detoxing. All that are canteens of water. What's underneath your bed? Late asleep, it's a bottle of liquor. So this is excellent. We've laid shit to rest. Um and we know that it exists. It's like the monster underneath our bed. But this is like from our yesteryears. This is from, um, and whatever like this might symbolize to you. Because like I, I haven't had a drink like in a while. And I'm fine with it. Like I haven't. But some, a lot of people have had that struggle. Um, For me, I think, for me, it's that essence, and you, some of you might vibe with this too, is wanting the Ten of Cups, and knowing that that Tenth Cup right there is, is like, like a no good one, you know, it's, um, it poisons the rest of the well. So for me, that battle is aiming for that Ten of Cups when, um, it's clearly not there, and, um, mm-hmm. So this person is clearly, I'm just noticing, clearly showing the bottom of her foot. Um, it is the left foot on here. So it's um, being um, humbled um, by the fact that, you know, the art of storytelling isn't just to, like, um, create... Um, this atmosphere, like romanticize the glory days, but also um, the element that um, you know brought us to like start this journey. Our missteps, um, not not um, stand like not um, starting on the right foot. Um, so sh in, um, showing the bare left foot is um, being honest, um, holding integrity, and. Um, that validity um, within the total journey and um, is striking when it comes to this vibe of the Nine of Cups. Usually in the Rider Waite Smith, the person is sitting down, leaning back, they're amongst an arch of cups, standing upright before him and right behind him. No feet are showing, no legs are showing, but here, something quite different. Mm -hmm. Um, so, um, most definitely. There's also cigarettes here, but, like, it's, it's an empty pack, so some of you might also have had to deal with that. I wanted to pop through. Ten of Swords in reverse. It is the dawn of a new day. This is excellent, because now we get to have that trampoline effect. Spirit's like saying... You know, we don't need to stay down anymore. We can get back up. Um, yeah. 
So being that we already are experiencing nine of cups in our own worthiness and our own triumphs um, within our own challenges, um, it's, we get to experience the trampoline effect of the rising phoenix. We've given ourselves an automatic boost. Our higher selves has shown us that this wanted to open its door. You saw that. Um, it made a sound. It wasn't a creak. It was a clear open. Um, it's forgoing those battles. It's laying things to rest when it comes to our obsessions, our addictions. Um, what other things does that um, indicate here? I forget there's more than, to it than that, but that's what I'm getting for that. So this is excellent. Um, yeah. Things that were just toxic for us. I think this is excellent. There's two, four, six, eight, like a total of like nine kids <laughs> that are rounded up that are going to be taken out to like brunch. Cute. Okay, what is that? Nine of coins. How excellent is that? Excellent, excellent. It's abundance. It's independence. It's minding your own business and stocking up, like figuring out how to make a house, like a fixer upper into a home. Definitely. And, and it just takes time to get that done. Like regardless of who caused that wreckage or, you know, buying into a, a, a house that you thought that was like being deceived in the home like you know a happily ever after and it's it's you know it wasn't somebody just bailed out when they decided to i'm getting also that this is like a dad so some of you might have had that you know yeah i'm getting that that's the first time that i got that um yeah um most definitely. Four, five, six. The good thing about this, I, this is the first time that I'm seeing this, um, I'm because I I was drawn to the guns right there. Okay. Or the what do you um, I was drawn to that. So I was counting them all, and he's taking the seventh gun. That's he's. Um, that's all that he's taking so we have to be thankful for that fact that he's um like he knows he's doing wrong he knows he's doing something really like not great um, um but the fact is is that what spirit leaves us behind with is um six of swords which is um the ability to be able to find peace mm -hmm. Definitely. It just takes some added reflection on it because we have the four of swords down here with the four, um, you know, that remain here. Um, there was already some present conflict because that he's the fifth person right there. So that's like five of wands hidden in there, which is an area of conflict. Um, so he's going to leave that be and it's going to be a better home because of that. Like, I know that some of you are going to be like, what? Uh, that's nothing but, but you'll, you will see the blessings that come from it. I, I have confidence that you already are being that we have the nine of cups on the initial slide and then the nine of pentacles prefixing that. Okay, anything else? Okay, here we go. Six of wands in the making, in the coming. Victory is coming. I'm facing the five of swords here. Okay, so um, before that happens, we're going to see, um, or leading up to that, you know, a battle of egos. Like, even though we won, Spirit is reaffirming this, even though we won, 
um, it doesn't really feel like it, you know, especially if you have someone that left a home that clocked out a long time ago, um, that, you know, it's the whole constant one up. Everything is a competition. And, um, so there's victory coming in this, like it, it can't last 20% battery that can't last forever that warring is due to cease at least for you know part of that scene so um, even as they are separated even as things are mediated um, they're still going to have to carry on with their um, their trials you know playtime is over between the two of us you know in between said parties okay this one Mm, hanged man so it's going to take some reflection it's going to feel like we're maybe trapped like put on trial almost um but this suspension is um like i thought that was like a mosh pit like a lot of people here but it's only an illusion this person that is is attempting to make us feel like cornered in a certain way like held back um ridiculed it's an illusion. It's just a falling away of leaves. It's, um, it's, oh my gosh, it's camouflage for their own insecurities, their defensiveness to the world. You just have to be, happen to be the most immediate subject. So, um, yeah, it's, it's a matter of reflection and knowing your own power to the point where that person has targeted you and made you feel threatened. Um, to the point where, like, they want to convince you that, um, you are in the wrong. There's so much denial there. Do you see there's a one-up on their face? I don't know if you see it there. But, like, even that, that's, like, that's, that's easy to get out of. So what's wanted to show itself? Eight of Cups. We can escape that and, um, and find ourselves again, like, without them. Mm -hmm. Spirit is offering this peace because there is no peace offering within this situation. Um, Spirit will offer us peace. Spirit will help us along with our journey to find ourselves again. Mm -hmm. Okay, bottom of the deck, King of Cups, that spirit right there, just like watching, like on the lookout in the underworld and on the lookout, like. Seriously, spirit, spirit is so wonderful. Holy crud. Okay, cut the deck. I'm told. Oh, Empress, what the heck? No way. Yes way. <laughs> That's insane. Okay, top of the deck. I'm just curious. Page of Swords, finding the truth. This is like the third time it has shown up consecutively. You know, you know. That's so crazy. We have some new recruits too when it comes to like our team <laughs> it's fucking awesome like what my i'm like salivating here that's insane <laughs> okay spirit you win again <laughs> thank you <laughs> okay that's it for now um uh yeah well that's it okay um uh, have a good day <laughs> let me put this away um yeah, if I don't see it tomorrow, have a happy Thanksgiving. <laughs> and um, I just opened it up to put it away. And we got the Eight of Wands. It's fast moving. It's excellent. It's excellent. Things are good. Things are vibing. Congratulations for getting this far, Tina and crew. <sighs> okay, let's breathe. <laughs> okay, well. Hope that helps you. Give you that extra motivation for this new moon in Sagittarius. We have declared our intentions. We have done it. We have sounded the trumpets. We are here. We are here at last. Her. We are her at last. Okay. Thank you to my divine support and sponsors. Um, yeah. Thank you. Be on the veil and here and now. Okay. Uh, catch y'all later. Uh, bye for now. <laughs>